Alright, so what is good YouTube? It's your boy Legendary EA and we are back here for another rebuild. Obviously yesterday I did go ahead and double upload. I'll be starting off with my next My League series as well as a Thunder rebuild. Well, if you guys enjoyed that, make sure you go ahead and like up, and, uh, like up this video and of course subscribe. Let's get 100 likes for more rebuilds. Uh, today I will be trying to double upload for sure. Maybe even throw in three videos. Who knows? It just depends on how much time I actually have, but... Obviously, we got the Toronto Raptors. Life after Kawhi Leonard dipped on them, boy, after winning them a championship. I think it's going to be fun. So, guys, just let me know what you guys think about it in the comment section below. Make sure you go ahead and like it up. Obviously, we got Pascal Siakam, the only untouchable player in this entire thing. But after him, we got Kyle Lowry. I'm I, I'm probably going to re-sign him, but at a way lower rate. Uh, Marcus Saul, Serge Ibaka. Fred Van Vliet, Rondé Allen Jefferson, Norman Powell, Stanley Johnson, OG Anobi, Patrick McCall, Matt, yeah, look. They even have Cameron. Nah, man, that ain't it. But anyways, guys, this reboot would not be realistic. I'm waiting for somebody to finish up, like, making all the rookies and for all the Kings to really be out of the game before I start up the realistic rebuilds. But but my My GM series, my My League series is realistic, so make sure you go ahead and check that out. Girl, listen, I'm trying to win... And make the best Raptors team possible. So we're not going to waste no time. What's the market out there for, for him? I mean, I guess there's a way where I can sim this first season to at least see where we're at. Because I, I, I am kind of curious about where we're actually at. What are they saying about us, though? Where, where's it at? Where's the power rankings at? What, what are they saying about us? Where, where they got us ranked? 10th? I don't know about that. I, I kind of want to just let. I kind of just want to leave this team alone, and see how they deal without me touching anything for this first season. I, I kind of want to do that. Matter of fact, let's just go ahead and do that. Um, number one scoring option is Lowry. Actually, screw that. This is Yakum and then Lowry. I just want to see some. If we good. That means I don't need to be, like, shook in my last two seasons. If we're bad, then we, then we get a top draft pick. We, we don't lose re regardless. So, let's just see how good we are. But we already taking mad L's. And at the end of season number one, LeBron wins another MVP. That's what's up. John Moran wins rookie of the year. Uh, D'Angelo Russell's sixth man of the year. And, I mean, we do get most of the player with Fred Van Bleet. That's pretty cool. We, we went 42-40, and 40, so we, we were literally in the most average team in the NBA. We really weren't all that good, but we, we weren't bad either. Yeah, I, I hate to be in that position. It really, really sucked because there's really nothing to look forward to. All right, we made the playoffs as a fifth seed because we are in the Eastern Conference. Um, as far as the stats go, we're letting points by Siakam and Lowry, both averaging 20.5 points a game. Both these guys were solid. I mean, like I said, I would rather lose games than be average, bro. Like, like for real. I, I would much rather lose games than just be average. Where they got us ranked? All right, we're going to be out of the lottery. Round pick number 19? That ain't it. Now, I am going to be simming the playoffs because, like I said, I haven't even touched this team yet. I haven't done anything. This is just a trial run to see how far we could actually get. Can we can we get smoked in round one, though? We're we going to see. Because realistically, I, th I think that the Pistons team is slightly better, to be honest. All right, yeah, we, we eliminated in seven. I'm cool with that. We are going to start making a lot of changes this offseason. Trades. We're going to try to re-sign Kyle Lowry because, I mean, he's, he's an 85 and 2K. Maybe maybe sign and trade him somewhere else. Bring back Marcus All. But we got to make something happen. Like, this isn't the Thunder Rebuild where we had a bunch of draft picks and, like, and, and can make so many trades. It's going to be a little bit more difficult. The, the Lakers won't win a championship. Good for them. Let's get into this offseason, though, because I'm really looking forward to it. All right, let's see what we got. Player retirements. I think LeBron normally retires in year number two. Um, draft lotto. We walk away with the 18th pick. Yeah, that ain't it. <laughs> like That simply is not it. The staff signing, Nick Nurse is saying here, we're going to fire the assistant coach, though. Get us a better one. All right. Uh, yeah, we got, the, we got the better trainer already. There's no need to even... Mess with that at all. Straight to the NBA draft. Who are we projected to be even getting? Way down here, somebody that is not real. So, I will pass on that. Like, I will easily pass on that. What's it looking like out here?
honestly, bro, I'm going to hop into the NBA draft for one reason. I'm willing to trade up. I'm willing to trade up. It says that they were predicted to be getting LaMelo Ball. All right, the Washington Wizards, there's no way that they take LaMelo. They take James Wiseman. There's no way that, that the Grizzlies take LaMelo. Right? Right? They take him. Okay. I don't like that. <laughs> like, I really don't like that. Where are they at? It's, all right, he pops up in Trade Finder. Okay. They're going to make this shit hard. We need a point guard. Or, like, a two guard. We're going to see what we can do here. All right. I know that sometimes it's 2K lets you finesse it a little bit. I know it's it's nasty to take Norman Powell. I know. He ain't worth this much though. We're not we're not gonna Stanley Johnson. I didn't even want him. Okay, we make a box budget trade. We make that happen. That's the only trade we we picked up Lamelo Ball. His overall should be good. He's an 80. So who they even take with with our pick? Some some random dude. Uh, yeah, I'm I'm straight on that. We're gonna sign Lamelo to the squad. I bring back OG Anobi, Pascal. We're gonna restrict him. Let's restrict everybody because they can still be moved. All right. Obviously, we gotta bring him back. <laughs> like he's the highest overall player here. We're gonna, of course, bring him back. Who else? Kyle Lowry. Best interest to bring him back. It's in our best interest to bring all these guys back. To be real. I'm not renouncing any of them though. Like let's let's relax. I still want them back. I'll bring back Demar. Oh man, he not he not feeling us. That's interesting though. Demar, you know you want to come back here. Don't don't even don't even act like you don't. Man, man is tripping. He knows he wants to come back here. Jalen Brown's restricted. I don't even really want to go that route. Honestly, yeah. Let's just get all these guys back. All right, because now that we did that, we can actually start to make some trades. All right, I want to start Lamelo there. Or I could, we're 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 gonna see what we can get though. What is Kyle Lowry's value? If there's nothing good there, I am I am definitely okay with like moving. I'm definitely okay with starting him and Lamelo. Tobias Harris at small forward is insane. This might be the move. We we can bring back Demar Derozan. What other trades are there? Uh, this trade ain't that good. Tobias and Josh Richardson. I I can't just get Chris Minos in. I do think it's funny to bring back DeMar. I kind of want to bring back DeMar, bro. I kind of want to do that. Like, he he de he deserves to at least have a chance to win a championship. We're not going to give up a lot for him, though. I, I don't even want him, to be honest. Stop. Y'all don't even want him. No. Stop trying to I don't know. We're gonna try to do do, do this without No, we're not giving up Kyle Lowry. I refuse. Alright. Well that's not gonna happen then. Um Marcus Saul Marcus Saul and McCall. I'm gonna I'm I'm gonna take that trade, bro. <laughs> I'm gonna pick up Tobias Ayers. It's it, it keeps popping up in my face. 
There's no way I could just say no to that. And it's exactly what we need because he goes up at small forward. So right now we're looking like this. I, I, I play LaMelo at shooting guard. And our starting lineup is still really, really good. All right, let's still look at a Kyle Lowry trade. Yeah, none of these really benefit us. All right, so the move is to play LaMelo at shooting guard. He goes up to an 82 overall. This is the palest LaMelo I, I've ever seen. Uh, but Kyle Lowry and Van Vliet, LaMelo, Harris, and Anobi. We need some backup bigs. And I would like to sign another center, if possible, to like start there. Hassan Whiteside is somebody that I'd be interested in. Also possibly look at getting Palm. No, he said no. He said hell no. Um, Miritic, hope you enjoyed your time overseas. Come try to play here. Uh, all right, we got no more. All right, we do get Hassan. We cannot get Miritic. I'm going to take Hassan, though. All right, what else are we looking like? All we need is a backup four. A backup four, and I would like a backup, you know, shooting guard as well. But so far, I still think that we did really, really well. All right. Bryn Forbes, of course. I'd like to pick that up. We get Bryn Forbes. Uh, Europe, go. Come play. There we go. Is, and is there anybody else here? Iggy? Ig Iggy not playing here. Mello? <laughs> Honestly, I think we got a way better team. Team is way better. Maybe not the best team possible. But as far as the, this second season goes, I, I think that we're working solid. It's Kyle Lowry, LaMelo Ball, Tobias Harris, Pascal Siakam, and, and Hassan Whiteside. I mean... From what we had the year before, even though we did have Marcus Saul, the value for for Mark, I'm sorry, it outweighs. Like it, it clearly does. So, so Tobias Harris is better than Marcus Saul. So that was a trade that we definitely won, and I think that we can definitely win way more than 42 games, especially by the time that we're done with this as well. All right, let's get in training camps, training camps, perimeter shooting. Actually, hold on, this is what we're gonna do. Combo guard, we're gonna give that to Lamelo. Untap potential, we're going to give that to see Occam. I still want him to get better and better. And let's just head into this next season. All right, let's get it. They got, they got the correct lineup. Backups, Ibaka, Van Vliet, Forbes. I like it. Matter of fact, I want to change this, though. Well, that's about it. Well, hold on. Before I do that, this is easier. The bench playing too much. There we go. What do they got us ranked? Still a rebuilding team. Last year, we were ranked 10th. We're ranked 5th right now. Yo, let's see if we can mess around and make the playoffs. Well, we made the playoffs last year. Let's see if we can actually, you know, win a round and possibly win a championship. We're going to have to just wait and see. And I think in the season number two, we're, we are a lot better. I mean, we win 55 games. Giannis is the MVP. Our boy LaMelo wins rookie of the year. He put up 22 points to four rebounds, nearly seven assists, two steals on 48% shooting from the field and 39 from the three. That's actually really, really insane. Marcus saw six man of the year now in Philly. And, okay, we really, I mean, hey, as long as – Lamelo Bald, I'm I'm really cool. I'm I'm really cool cool with that to be honest. Uh, all right, so actually not that bad, man. It's actually a, a major improvement to be honest. Major improvement. Uh, this year we're the first seed in the Eastern Conference. I love that a lot as well. Uh, stats, 
Yeah, he he he, he led us in, in scoring. Pascal Siakam just got screwed. Yeah, that man just got straight screwed, bro. He went down. He dropped from 20 points to 13. That's to Lamelo went up to an 85. Tobias with 19. Kyle Lowry with dude, he got he got the short end of the stick, bro. But that's tough. Was Lamelo an All Star though? Where can we see that at? They hold. Come on now, dog. They hold. They definitely hold. All right. No, it's, it's, it's cool. Round one versus the Orlando Magic. Can, can we at least take these guys out? I, I would think so. I mean, they're the AC, right? <laughs> yeah, that's how it should go. Can we get them with that sweep? No? Okay. Gentleman sweep. Up against Philly. Come on, man. With number one seed, should not be too difficult. Dude, Lamella's low key OP, bro. Oh no, come on, go up three. Oh god, what is going on? Dude, that man put up some numbers. He put up some numbers. We gotta win this, or we just take an L. Awesome, just awesome. Now we are coming back for one more season. I like what I saw. We proved that we can do it during the regular season. We're just gonna add some more pieces to carry us throughout the playoffs. And this is probably the part where I trade away Kyle Lowry. To be honest, <laughs> this is probably that part. And Philly wins the championship. Come on now. Next year, it's got to be us in year number three. Has to be. All right, LeBron don't even retire. Let's get straight to the staff signings. All right, Nick Nurse is still there. Everybody that we need is still there. Let's improve our trainer, though. We might as well. There we go. We even have a draft pick this year? Nope. So this ain't got nothing to even do with us. Straight to the team player options. Don't got any of those as well. All right, and heading into this season, this is what we got, man. Same team. We brought in Brad Wanamaker. We brought back Danny Green, but his overall just dropped a lot. But it's pretty much the, the exact same team. And, of course, JaVale McGee. And now they said that we are contending... I, I, I still want to just, I want to see what this man is worth. If we can upgrade at point guard, that could help us out. DeMar DeRozan is still there. We're not getting DeMar. But I do want to I do want to upgrade at point guard or guard in general. I, I really just need a guard because LaMelo can just play the other one. Who Who is actually attainable here? Did we go after D-Book? I'm not going after Mike. Actually, I will go after Mike Conley. Bruh. Honestly, I'm down to, 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 to let this thing ride. Because uh, I, I think that we're going to be fine no matter what we actually do. So, I'm actually cool with the team that we got right now. Still running that nine-man rotation. That's cool with me. Bench is not going to be playing like that. Uh, let's, sorry, my my guys. I want him getting so many minutes, bro. More than we need you. Actually, hold on. Surge, Surge is going to be the backup four. I'm sorry. Your rep go? Actually, actually, uh, I'm a... It don't really matter. Can... can, can I'm going to just... I'm, I'm just leave it alone. Because it already says that we are c contending. Why would I mess with that? They got us ranked third. Is this year that we can finally win a championship? And it looks like we made the right moves because, um, yeah, 55 wins, scratch that. 62 and the freaking MVP. <laughs> yo, yo, if you guys are doing this, he's OP. He's he's overpowered. Whoever made this j j jack move made him OP. This man put up 32 points. This is his second season. 32 points, four and a half boards, 
8.4 assists, two steals, shooting 51% from the field and 43 from the three. That's just not even fair. And he and he and he's also the most improved player as well. We we get coached here with Nick Nurse as he goes 62 and 20. Bruh. This man literally took he literally took right where Kawhi left off. He he just took that spot. That is actually okay. There's no way that we lose now. There's there, there's just no way. Yo, it was so, yo trading all, all that stuff was definitely worth it. Now, definitely worth it. He's an 89. This man is OP, bro. Look, if we if we take an L anywhere before the finals, I'm gonna be heated. Like for real. Oh my gosh, we're down 0-2 against the freaking Wizards. I'm sleep. This y'all do not even do this. Don't do this. <laughs> Please don't do this. <laughs> Yo, that that would be insane. All right, bruh. <laughs> he dropped fifty one. Oh my gosh, dude. He dropped fifty one on their heads. Oh my gosh. <laughs> He, he follows it up with this man is, is is on some James Harden shit, forty points, ten assists, seven steals. Tie that shit up real quick. Wait, how much is he averaging in the playoffs? Dude, that is insane. That is insane. Yo, we gotta take the lead right now. We need to, and we're playing at home. I don't know why we couldn't just do this from the beginning. Twenty six. In 10. Oh my gosh. They juiced this man. They juiced him. 27, 11, and 9. Yo. <laughs> that shit is insane, bruh. Can he do it against the Nets, though? Why are we, we keep going down 0 2? Lamelo, please, please don't fail me. I, I need you to do it again. Control the lead. There we go. <laughs> Fucking goodness. He did this shit again. And he's doing it efficiently as well. 47 and 13. 15 and 21 shooting 5 of 11 from the 3. How, what more can you possibly ask for? We're simcasting the rest of, of the playoffs. Simple as that. Come on. I need I need that comeback. Dang. He's up 37. That's actually ridiculous though. Like, he's overpowered, bro. I don't want to jump in this game. All right, we, we, we clutch it out. Force the game seven. Now we kind of have, you have to force a game seven now. Comfortable lead. We straight. And now he's cooling off a little bit, but we need 50. We need that right now. We blowing these guys out of the water. He dropped 50. <laughs> I literally said, we need 50. He dropped 50. He dropped 50. Dude, this is ridiculous. We're taking on Boston. How much is he averaging? This shit is insane. He's averaging 30 points for the entire... That is ridiculous. I'm simcasting it, bro. Because whenever we simcast, he put up crazy numbers every single time. Oh, no. I ain't, I ain't trying to play the game, though. Hold on. 29. Come on, you guys. Nice little dub. He dropped 41. Keep it going. Okay, 27. We're up 3 0. I, I need this nice little sweep. Yeah, Simcast is the way to go. 52 again. Dude, I'm f dude, I don't know what the hell to say. Like I've I've never seen this. Like this is only my second rebuild, but if you guys can get LaMelo in the game, you you do it. Okay? <laughs> you do it. Up against Dallas in the NBA Finals. This is insane. If he's not Finals MVP, he did it the entire playoffs. He got to do it during the finals. 45, 5, 12, and 7 steals in his first NBA finals. In his first, bro, this is, this is ridiculous. 
This is his second season. He's up 34. I, if I would have hopped in, we probably would have won that game. Come on, you guys. Come on, y'all. He's up 43. We need to tie up the series right now. Like, for real. For real. Wrap this thing up, y'all. Good stuff. He dropped 46. We're up. To, it's tied up 2-2. Two, two. Let's take the 3-2 lead right now. We need to right now. Come on, y'all. It's a close game. Dang. He's playing great. We need to force the game seven, though. Let's force the game seven. Blow these guys out. That's what I'm talking about. 34. How much is he averaging in the finals, bro? If he's not finals MVP, who is? He's averaging damn near 40 points in the finals. This shit is not right. <laughs> like, that's all I'm going to say. Like, he, he wins MVP his second season, and he's doing this. I, I need us to win this game, and I'm definitely going to hop in if, if I need to. Come on, y'all. Come on, y'all. Come on, y'all. A minute 27. LaMelo got 28 and 15. At this point, I always got to make sure that we don't blow this game. That's it. And we're NBA champ. Dude, there was no way I was willing to lose this shit, bro. Like, the performance that LaMelo's doing, MVP and doing all. Yeah, that makes me really, really, really want to get him now for, for my next series. This man is overpowered. Like, it's, it's as simple as that. He's overpowered. Let's get it. Light work. Light work. For some reason, they got this little weird lineup going going on with Tobias Harris as shooting guard. I mean, it's working. Here's Cole Anthony. I'm pretty sure that's Cole. That sh oh, my. We, can we, we can't block that. Now they're going to make us, like, c compete. Come on now. <clears throat> dude, dude, do something with the rock, please. Chris Ops is fine. They got Gordon Hayward on the team. Go mellow. Move out the way. Oh, wow. Wow, that, that shit feels so easy and, and just smooth. Weird little shot. We got 30. 30 and 15. He's finals MVP. He's playoffs MVP. He's regular season MVP as well. Man is OP. That was the best. Like, I knew that I want to get him because we need a guard. But, like, there was... Fuck out it, dude. That's BS. There, there's no way that I could see him putting up these kind of numbers. Like, there was just simply no way I, I, I could see him p putting up these kind of numbers. Green! Oh, my God! Dude, this dude is OP. Shit is green. That's game. That man just iced that shit. Yeah, there, there's there's no way that I saw him putting up these numbers, but I was, I was willing to give up those draft picks and players. Best thing I could have possibly done. Not even close. Not even close at all. This man carried. He straight carried. Like, don't don't foul. There's no need to foul him. That's the thing. There there's really no need to foul him. We already won this game. But I like I just can't get over. How insane he actually is, which means for my Knicks series, I have to get him. Like, I, I have to make sure that I, I secure that number one pick. I don't want any chances of not getting him. Like, the dude is overpowered. Like, this man stepped back. We we had a, That was my first jump shot with him, and we just splashed a three. Like, it was nothing. That is ridiculous. But obviously, in the end... We're champions, so there, there's no need for me to keep on showing you guys this for the next 22 seconds or like two minutes. Let's just get straight into, into the celebration because it's pretty obvious that at this point now, we're champions. And they've done it for new NBA champions. What am 
moment it is right now to see the team who played so well together enjoying this NBA championship moment. And you talk about a defining moment. This is it. They have played so well together. They deserve every ounce of this NBA championship moment. And seeing this team come together over the course of the season and on into the playoffs, what a joy. I mean, there is no better champion the league could have asked for. And a pleasure here at 2K Sports to be with you all season long. But in the end, we are NBA champions. I'm pretty sure that the finals MVP went to LaMelo. Obviously, you guys saw this game. The servers are complete trash. Yeah, he was finals MVP, obviously. I mean, we can look at his stats real quick. Uh, where is it at? Where is it at? In the NBA finals, this man averaged 39 points, 4 rebounds, 8 assists, 3 steals, while shooting 56% from the field. And 46% from, from the three. Regardless, I hope you guys enjoyed this rebuild. I did not know he would become this cold, but our final roster was Pascal Siakam, LaMelo Ball, Tobias Harris, Kyle Lowry, Hassan Whiteside, Serge Ibaka, Brent Forbes, Fred Van Vliet, OG Anobi, JaVale McGee, Brad Wanamaker, Matt Thomas, Jonas Repko, Terrence Davis, Danny Green returns for another championship. I hope you guys enjoyed this, man. Make sure you go and like it up and, of course, subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Yo, LaMelo, I'm definitely getting him for, for, for my next series without a doubt. I, I tried the whole house. This man won the MVP in his second season. Finals MVP. It was just overpowered. Like, just completely overpowered. But other than that, I'll see you guys in the next one. I'm out. Peace, y'all.